Go from here. This is a float switch. It's normally closed. This is open. With a self-locking function, it locks up. Wiper spray function, this is the wiper switch. This is forward gear. Back gear is neutral in the middle. It's in first gear now. This is the second gear. Turn it on here is the switch for this headlight. This is a left turn, so this is a right turn. So, in the middle, this is four-wheel steering. On the left is turning on four-wheel steering. In the middle is two-wheel steering. That's the crabbing pattern on the right. Handle here, to the left is the bucket. To the right is the bucket. Forward is the forearm, and back is the arm lift. These two buttons, and this one, there is another button at the back. These four buttons, normally, it is the button for installing the device, reserve for attachments. This way, this switch is a quick change switch for the back excavator. This is a police light. This is the emergency light switch. This is the headlight switch of the back excavator. This is a wiper for the rear window to spray water. This is the wiper for the rear window. This is the uphill auxiliary feature. This is from the back. Side shift clamping switch. This is a wheel lock. This is a shaft lock. This is also a float switch. This is an air conditioner. This is file. ER sensor. Here is the cold wind. Here is the hot air, the cold air on. AC must be turned on. AC button on. When the slide is on, the air conditioner will run. Here it is. When the air conditioner compressor is not running. This is domestic circulation. And then, first down, the first time you turn it on, the whole car is powered on. The second time you twist it again, the vehicle will start. Turn off! Turn it off completely. It is a state of power outage for the whole car. This is the handbrake. Pull it up and put it down. Here it is. A high and low speed. When lying flat, it is in a low speed state. It is in a high speed state when pulled up and standing. To here. This is the left leg. This is the right leg. Down is the straight leg. Up you strain your legs. This is the hand throttle. In idle state, push forward the bigger, the faster it goes, the higher the speed. The left handle here controls the excavator. Pushing to the left means the excavator turns left. Pushing to the right means the excavator turns right. To push forward is to push forward with both arms. Pulling back is two arms retracting. If it is with telescopic function, these two, extend and contract. Here it is. Speaker, back excavator horn. The button at the back is left and right sideways. Move to the left. The handle here is to the left, which is the bucket. To the right is the bucket. Pull back is the arm up. Pushing forward is the big arm. These two buttons are the breakers. This one is, if there is an excavator in the car, change it quickly. This is the quick change button. The button at the back moves left and right. 